Your Eminence, may I congratulate you on another successful campaign? Yes, it was very successful, wasn't it? Um, how many star systems have we conquered now? This is a four star system this week. That means you have 340, 347 star systems since you ascended to the throne. Excellent. Don't you normally do? So I'm some of my advisors that have shown some promise. Inform the navigation room to plot for for next conquest. Um, about that, sir. Um, there's one problem. Or we don't have any more advisors to rule the star systems. Already? I have anticipated this problem. But I haven't thought we would reach this yet. Fortunately, I had the lab start working on the solution. They gave me this just this morning. Because I have advisors. We will simply find new young people to replace them. But your, wait, but your eminence? Mm -hmm. But your eminence? Where will we find them? Remember, there's a, you can only have your advisors be of royal blood or at least um, noble, noble blood. The question, my dear Espinos, is not where we will find more, it is when we will find more. Just keep 
keep our heads on straight and eyes and ears open. I'm sure we'll find out something. We should pray. God knows what's going on and he will protect us. Yeah. Good idea. God, we're scared. We don't know what's happening, but we know you're in control. We know you'll take care of us. Thanks. Amen. I'm sure you all are a little confused about what's happening right now. That's to be expected. This will be your new life. You have been elected from the billions of people throughout time to serve His Imperial Majesty, Nebuchadnezzar. In the capacity of Royal Advisors on Starship Babylon. You'll be trained by the best instructors of all time. You will learn our ways. You, are, you will understand our laws. You will become one of us. Those are, who cannot overlap or measure up will be put to work in the dust bins. Suffice to say, in your best interest to success, to succeed. To succeed. Your journey will begin immediately. You will be escorted to the dining hall for your first lessons in court editing. Etiquette. Finally, I'm so hungry. What's your name? Azura, Azura. Not anymore. Your name is now Abednego. In fact, you will all be getting new names to match your new station in life. You will find your name tags at your table seat. All right, you read it on the end of the bus. That way. Shadrach, huh? Uh, I don't know if I like it. My new name is Make Me Shack. What's your name, do you know? It's awful. It can't be worse than a Bendigo. Come on. Come on. Well, patches are. <laughs> I told you it was terrible. I am not going to get used to it. You will be given only the best. Your food will be served directly from his... Imperial Majesty's table. Eat, please, and, and enjoy. Oh, we can't eat that. <laughs> but I'm so hungry. You know that food forbidden by God. It will go against as well to eat it. Then what do we do? We can't starve either. Maybe you can figure out a solution. Look, let's just ask. Excuse me, sir. Um, we can't eat this kind of food. What? This is the best food in the entire empire. Perhaps the best in all time. You refuse to eat it? God has told us we cannot eat this kind of food. I'm sorry. Is 
Is there something else we could eat? It won't do. You make me look bad. Good. All these others will be healthy and fat. You will waste away to nothing. Absolutely not. What if we just had a test first? Just a little while. Say 10 days or so. Give us only vegetables to eat. While the rest of them eat this food, give us only vegetables and water. And if we're and if we look better than them, we can continue to eat the vegetables. But if we look worse than them, then we can then we'll eat that food. Very well. Bring these folk bring these four some vegetables and water. You all four are head and shoulders above everybody else. You may continue to eat vegetables for as long as you do so well. You've all done very well. Beyond this story is the emperor himself, his imperial majesty Nebuchadnezzar. He will be interviewing you each individually individually to see how you measure up and to determine where you you are to serve. Good luck.
Tough one. I sure, I'm sure I'm glad that there's more than one of us with all the tough decisions the Emperor has to make. You know, have you ever wondered why he called him so much? He calls on one of us three way more than anyone else. You know, I thought about that too. Maybe it's just because God has blessed us so much with all the Emperor's wise decisions that he has made. That and great veggie snacks, and we can't go wrong. It says pronounce. Do you think people love me? Uh, your eminence? I'm sure. Uh, I'm sure they do. You think they really love me? I think we need a way to let the people show that they love me. Some avenue or an outlet. For them to express their love. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, of course. Here. That'd be nice. Of course it would. We're going to sit down at the tomb now. It's the perfect set. I think a large holographic. Oh yes! A holograph would be great. We'll have all the band. We'll have the bands playing all your favorite songs. Then everyone will bow down to my. They will worship me. They will acknowledge how, just how amazing I am. They will prove to me that they look. Yes, sir. That would do the trick, I suppose. You suppose. Aspen, as the people must know that I've drawn her. They must recognize that I am their supreme ruler. They must show they own everything to me. In fact, and let this be known to the entire ship. If they don't bow down, they'll be regarded as trash. Treated in treated as trash, in fact. Yes. Well, we will throw them into the incinerator. Are you sure that's necessary? I mean, yes, yes! That's what scoundrels like them would deserve! But who wouldn't want to bow down and worship the image of you? I, I mean, really. Nebuchadnezzar is the greatest ruler of the world in all the time that is ever known. We will, sh we will show him the respect and honor that is due him. When you hear the imperial song begin to play, you must bow down before the image of the great deliverer. If anyone should, if anyone should fail to comply with these instructions, he will be henceforth and um, forever known as only the trash and rubbish that is cast out and burned. He will be thrown into the incinerator and his name stricken from all history. I don't feel so good. Maybe if you wouldn't have eaten all that food, maybe you would have felt better. 
Don't falter now, guys. God will take care of us. Here we go. <laughs> So you three don't want to now? So you see all the times I've left on you for your advice. For, for the kindness of show. However, I am also for the mercy. I will give you another chance. The music will play again, but this time, you must bow down to the statue. You can play all the music you want. We won't bow. There's only one person we will bow to, and that's our God. You can throw us in the incinerator for all we care. We won't bow. God will protect us. But you know what? Even if he does get us out of there, even if we die in this way, we won't turn back on him. Won't give, give in to your... Because we know what God desires is way more important. What? You dared to defy me in front of my face. Get them out of here. To the incinerator with him. And make it hot. Even seven times hotter than normal. Get them out of my sight. Oh, oh I got this. Oh, oh, oh okay. Uh, just go in. Um. <laughs> Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, come out of here, there. What is there? What happened there? How are you in that bed? You don't even smell like smoke. We told you, our God, the God of everything, has protected us. He is, he is all-powerful and mighty. <clears throat> I want you to know, he wants you to know that he is ruler of everything. Well, he certainly got my attention. Listen up, everyone. From this day forward, no one is allowed to say anything against the God of these men. They faced in him, they went against the imperial orchards of the emperor himself. And God showed himself in an incredible way through him. 
There's no other god that can save the way he can. Come here, let's do this. Wait, does anyone have any marshmallows? <laughs>